13, she became the youngest solo artist ever to score a number one hit. And now at 18, pop star JoJo is gearing up for the release of her third album. She was at the Schubert Theater in New Haven last night. She was judging a casting call of young talent to perform at the Pilot Pen. And she took a few minutes to fill us in on her new CD. Well, I've already titled it. It's called All I Want Is Everything, um, and it's because there's a song on the album, which um, I've written, which is by the same title. And it just represents where I'm at in my life as an 18-year-old young woman, kind of at a crossroads. And um, I've been working on it for a while now, and I'm really excited to uh, let everyone hear some new material in a few months. And, you, yeah, your fans can expect it out soon, a couple of months from now, a few months, you're hoping. Well, we'll hear a single within a few months, mm -hmm. and the album hopefully fourth quarter of this year. I think most of your fans are familiar with two songs in particular that they associate with you, Get Out, Too Little, Too Late. Mm -hmm. Is this music similar in that respect? Um, I don't think so. I mean, I... I, I felt like I always tried to bring an element of, of soul to my music, mm -hmm. um, even with my first album when I was 13 and my second when I was 15. But now, um, you know, I'm living on my own. I'm kind of out in the world. I've written this whole album and co-written it and really taken the reins. So in that sense, it's totally different because I didn't get the chance to do that with my first two albums. But um, I'm just a lover of music, and that's really representative, um, represented on this. So it is, it is a bit of a departure. You had such a soulful voice, even at such a young age. Is that part of the reason you're here at this event for Pilot Pen, a casting call for young singers, young talent? Is that part of the reason that you wanted to be here because of your career taking off at what was the age of 13, maybe even earlier than that? Yeah, I mean, I got signed when I was 12, but I had been um, singing on national television since I was six. So I understand, you know, going to these open calls and, and being nervous, but actually, I actually was fearless. I, I was telling the, the kids that I was nervous, but... I don't know why I said that, because I was actually fearless. I would just go out and give it my all, and, and that's what a lot of these kids here are doing. So I was excited to be a part of it, because seeing these sweet, angelic children just, you know, belted out is so cute. Maybe you she was very sweet. She was great to talk to. Once again, her album, her new album, is called All I Want Is Everything. And JoJo tells me despite her success and her fame, she's keeping her priorities straight. She still lives in her native Boston, just a few miles away from her family. And we should mention that JoJo was a celebrity judge along with Desiree Fontaine and a, a uh, DJ from KC 101 for a casting call at the Schubert in New Haven last night. It was for children 12 and under to sing America the Beautiful at the upcoming Pilot Pen. There will be seven winners who will perform during each night of the tournament and also during the finals and those winners those seven winners will be announced coming up on June 30th so we'll keep you posted on that we also want to